Hello friends, are you worrying about your PC performance? Do you want to boost your PC performance but don't know how to do it? Okay, in this video, I'm going to introduce you an exciting and interesting tool designed by Microsoft itself which can help you to monitoring your PC performance and to help you to boost your PC performance easily. And the tool is very very accessible with screen readers so i hope this video will give you a lot of knowledge about advanced computer so please like the video and share the video with your community that all this side from accessible computing let's start the tool name is pc manager so first we need to download this tool. To download this tool, open your browser and type PC Manager. Then press enter. Manager, PC Manager, Google search. Then go to the first search results. Search main land, search main landmark, clickable search result, visited link. Visited link heading level three, Microsoft PC Manager, antivirus. So this is the link. Now press enter here. Antivirus, clean up PC. It will open this page. Antivirus, clean up PC. Clickable band visited link PC manager. Now find the download link. Button collapse the button download. Click here. Save as dialog. File name. Combo box collapsed. Edit alt plus n selected MS PC manager. So now just save the file or if you are using the default download options then the file will be available in your downloads folder. As I have already downloaded and installed this tool so I'll not do the same thing again. After downloading this tool, you need to install this tool and install is very simple. Now let's see how this tool will work. So I'm in my desktop and I'm launching this tool. PC Manager 20 of 28. I'm pressing enter on it. PC Manager window. Now this tool will Clean up. open. No PC Manager public data. Okay, so this is the tool and it is a web view so you can use your up arrow down arrow key to find the options. Now I'm pressing down arrow. Menu button collapse sub menu settings. Menu. So under settings you will find few things which we will see later. Button minimize. Then you can minimize. Button close. Then close. Main landmark region heading level 1 boost your PC's performance. Okay, so boost your PC's performance. In our mobile phone, we can see the cache files or some temporary files, right? But in PC, it was not possible earlier. But now it is possible with the help of this wonderful tool designed by Microsoft. Now I'm pressing down arrow here. Memory usage. Memory usage. So you can check your memory usage. 29%. 29%. So I'm using the 16 GB RAM. I have 2 RAM, 8 GB plus 8 GB. So out of 16 GB, only 29% is now using. Temporary files. Then temporary files. 412 MB. 412 MB. So you need to delete or you need to remove these files to boost your PC. But how do you know where the files are and how you can delete? Okay. You don't need to do anything just press down arrow again and button boost your pc's performance boost your pc's performance so we will see how the pc's performance will boost but before that let's see what are the options here out of region list with four items visited link health check health check so you can uh check your pc's health visited link check now to protect your pc okay then visited link storage management storage management so you can check what is the how many storage i mean how much storage is used and you can also do some settings visited link 136.3 gb available okay 136.3 gb available this is the storage of your c drive okay as i'm using an uh, as i'm using a ssd of 250 gb so that's why 136 GB is free. Link process management. Then process Link 13 management. Running. 13 running. 13 processes are running in background. Okay, I will show you how you can optimize your PC's performance by using this tool. So please stick to this video till the end. Visited link startup apps. Then startup apps. So you can configure which startup apps will open after the startup. 
Okay. Visited link last startup time. Out of list on main landmark list with four items. Visited link last startup time. Five, three iron pack taps. Okay. Out of list content info landmark tab selected cleanup. Cleanup and tab security. Security. So there are two tabs, cleanup and security. So now our focus is on the cleanup tab. First, we will see how you can boost your performance. I mean boost your PC's performance. So for this, I'm using B. Settings menu, but minimize, but close, but main landmark, boost your PC's. Per so I'm just pressing enter. Boosting unavailable. Boosting, boosting, clean 412 MB of temporary file set smart boost. Performance boosted. Perform. Boom. So our PC performance is now boosted. So let's see. B menu, but, but main landmark, clean 412 MB of okay. temporary button set smart boost. Set smart boost. Memory usage. Okay, see. 19%. Now memory usage is 90 per 19%, sorry 19%, not 90%. Temporary files. Temporary files, 0 KB. 0 KB, but if you just come back after a certain period of time, like 1 minute or 2 minutes, you can see a certain amount of files stored. So you can check and you can Button boost. performance boosted. Then performance boosted. Out of region list without ZM19. Okay, so let's click on set smart boost. Set smart Main boost. What's there? Let's see. Switch off temporary files. Switch. Switch okay. off smart files. Switch off smart boost PC manager will automatically boost your PC when high usage of RAM or there are 1 GB of. Switch off temporary files. Okay, so if boost there are 1 GB and above files and there are temporary files, then automatically the PC manager will run the boost performance and your performance, your PC's performance will boost. I am not recommend to do this right now. Uh, because I don't know what will be the exact effect because if you're working on a big project like say let, let's say you are editing videos or you are working on a big uh, software big programming languages or something else so maybe your work get lost so I'm not sure about it so that's why I'm not giving you any instruction on it first let me check then I'll tell you off or if you try then you should try on your own and uh, I'll not be responsible for anything happens or any issues occurs due to this. Start PC manager automatically start when PC I sign manager. into Windows. Switch off start PC off. Auto update okay. PC manager. Then auto update PC manager. Switch on, on. You are already running the latest okay. button check for updates. So you can check Current for updates. version 3.1. These are also available in the settings. Microsoft Defender Antivirus 4.18. Out of okay, so I'm pressing Click escape. PC menu button collapsed sub menus. Now see. But but may met twenty per temper zero button boot out of region list with four items visited link health check. Health check. Visited link check now to protect your PC. Check now to protect your PC and Visit, then visited link one hundred for link process management. Process management. So link thirteen. Click here. Out of list list with thirty. Out of see. main land and unused pro heading level one process management and unused processes to make your system run faster. Okay. List with thirteen items Google row? Chrome. Google Chrome memory usage 41.4 MB. So you can check whatever softwares are running and how much memory they are using. Google Chrome 41. Google memory usage MB. 41 button end. So if you end, then Google Chrome will stop. This is like recent apps in our phone. App Studio. App Studio, which I am using to record. Mem button end. Button end. So I cannot end. Okay. Mem Microsoft button memory usage. Go out of list and unused. Pro heading left banner land button minimize. Menu next button is select. I'm a skip. I'm pressing PC escape once. button button close. May end list map button my memory button end. Memory Microsoft out of list banner landmark button back. So at the top you will find the back button. So I'm pressing enter button, here. Button graphic PC manager. And now I'll check the PC health. Map button close. May map with temper zero button out of region list visited link check now to protect your piece. Pressing enter here. Out of list out of see. 25. Main landmark looking for issues. Heading banner landmark button. Main landmark looking heading level issues. one looking for issues. 75%, 100%. Okay. Clean up items found. Clean up items found. Button proceed. Proceed. Table with 10 rows and two columns. Proceed. Clickable expanded level clickable. Items to clean up. Row one column two zero point oh KB. Items to clean up grouping checkbox check recent file list. A recent file list will be deleted. Recent file row two column one 169 places. Out of grouping clickable expanded level 1 checkbox not check startup apps to disable. Startup apps to disable. So some apps will be disabled. Okay, if you uh, proceed. Click startup apps to disable. Startup apps to disable grouping checkbox not check Microsoft OneDrive. Okay, which startup apps you want to disable? 
okay so startup apps means this app will run automatically in background after starting up your pc my okay. low or i checkbox not checked up with gx browser assistant hi then microsoft see. onedrive microsoft onedrive then hi hi so it will use the high uh, i mean the usage of the application is very high after starting so you can check this box checked and click on proceed check opera gx browser assistant opera gx browser row 5 i check box not checked window security notification window icon security. window security row 6 low then low so low means it's okay check a real tech hd audio universe row 7 low it's low check box not checked brave vpn wire brave. card server brave vp row 8 medium check it's box medium. not checked application file for jaws application file for jaws application row 9 low Check box not checked CCX no. process. Out okay, of so let's main see. landmark table with 10 rows and 2 columns clickable expanded level 1 items to clean up check box checked. Click so. check box checked items to clean up. Clickable. Items to clean up grouping recent file list check box checked. So recent file clickable list. Clickable expanded level 1 startup apps to disable check box not checked. Startup apps to disable check box not checked. Checked. Clickable. Okay. Startup apps to disable. Startup apps to disable grouping check box checked Microsoft OneDrive. Okay, so I don't want to check all Clickable. the applications, so let me not, not check this then. Startup apps to disable grouping Microsoft OneDrive checkbox not checked. 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 Microsoft OneDrive I don't need, so I'll check this. Opera GX browser assistant checkbox not checked. Also, I am not checked, checking. Checked. Windows security notification. I real tech HD audio unit. Okay. Gray VPN wire checked. I'm checked. not checking this. Application file for JAWS CCX process checkbox not checked. Checked. Check. CCX process. Row 10 column 1 I. No next checkbox. So I'm just clicking proceed on. button. Proceed button. Eight percent, twelve percent, fourteen percent, sixteen percent, eighteen percent, forty percent, sixty percent, eighty percent, one hundred percent. Now it is Manal done. See main landmark health check completed. Heading level one. All actions completed. Button done. Okay, so click on done. Region temporary files. Now I'm going to do this tab. tab, tab security. security tab. Content info land. So let's see what's there under security tab. Banner landmark. PC manager menu button cl but button close main landmark region heading level one scan your PC for threats scan your PC for threats Microsoft Defender antivirus is ready so you can directly uh, scan from this application link allowed threats button scan your PC for threats okay then out of region list with four items visited link Windows update Windows update so you can check the Windows updates from here visited link updated 11 slash 5 slash 20 27 p.m. right link default browser settings Default browser link settings. Current settings. Google current Chrome. Settings. Link taskbar repair. Taskbar repair. So if you want to uh, know more about this tool, so please let me know. I'll try to create different different videos. Okay. Link restore taskbar appearance. Link pop up management. See pop up link management. Link pop up window. Out of list content up. info landmark tab. Mail link link link. So these are the options available. So if you want, you can just let me know in the comment section. Then I will make videos for you. Right now, I'm going to just going to show you how you can check the updates. Link, link default browse visited link update visited link windows up. Click here. Windows update. And now see. Windows when your battery is running low, select the battery on the taskbar. Then select back windows tips. Button check banner landmark graphic PC main la updated 11 slash 5 updated. slash button check now. So just click check, check now. now button no update found. No update when found. When your battery is running when your battery when your wind heading level one looking for updates. Looking for updates. Progress busy indicator. Yeah. Button check now. Updated. 11 sl updated. heading level 1 banner landmark button close. Button minima. Button okay. main landmark when your battery is running windows tips. So some tips are there. When your battery is running low, select the battery on the taskbar. Then select battery saver. Win button check now. Okay. So these are the tools which Ma you can easily use by using Microsoft PC Manager. Graphic PC man menu button collapse sub menu settings. So let's click settings, on settings. Feed settings one menu button expand switch off temporary files. So see, off, these are the PC settings. Man, switch off start off auto up switch on on URL button current version Microsoft the zero one zero link Microsoft privacy state checkbox not check one join button join button Microsoft button dismiss heading level button. Clickable banner land PC manager. Okay, so let me close this. Menu button minimize. Button close. Task. Okay, guys. That's it. How you can boost your PC performance and monitor your PC performance using Microsoft PC Manager. I hope you've learned a lot from this video. If really, then like the video and share the video with your friends and community. Don't forget to let us know in the comment section that how this tool helps you in your daily life. This tool can work with 
Windows 11 and hopefully Windows 10 and 8 also but probably Windows 7 it will not work and this tool may require the internet connection to work because I didn't try without internet connection if you want you can try and let us know into the comment section thank you friends for watching this video see you in the next video till then bye bye